Hi, this is Tab from FreeFly. In the last step, uh, we talked about tilt axis vertical CG adjustment. In this step, we're going to talk about balancing the roll axis. Um, before we get started, I want to point out there's two potential places that you can adjust the roll axis from. Uh, the first is the adjustable camera stage um, up in the front of the front of the movie. So this whole platform can slide left and right to allow you to achieve good roll balance. Just slide this left and right, clamp it down wherever you think it needs to go. Uh, the second point is this whole roll beam in the back can slide left and right. The reason there's two adjustment points is for some camera packages, the weight distribution left to right can be um, different, and we provide this adjustment in the back to allow you even to fit even a wider range of cameras. So from the factory, the roll beam comes set all the way over this way for packaging. Um, I would recommend that you slide it all the way the other way. The reason is to counteract the weight of this motor. Uh, it's, it's significantly off balance when the camera's not there, so we cheat it this way a little bit to have it so the camera is centered up after we balance it. So I'll snug those three M4 bolts up. They don't need to be super tight, just reasonably tight. Then let's put the camera back on. We're going to have to rebalance the tilt axis because obviously I've removed the camera. So just like before, I'll loosely tighten the toggle clamp to allow me to position the camera for tilt axis balance quickly. Okay, that's pretty good. Clamp that down. But as you can see, uh, roll axis is really heavy that way. So I'll loosen only the two outer toggle clamps, and that will allow me to slide this whole camera stage. So I'll just slide it slowly, checking the balance as I go. I'll just remove my hands and see if it wants to stay put on its own. So there it does. So I'll clamp that down, and then to confirm a uh, good roll balance, I'll go to different orientations, and it should want to stay. Uh, that means you are very accurate on the roll balance, so that's pretty good. Um, I would call that acceptable balance, and we can move on to balancing the pan axis. Thanks.